balloon rocket car. You'll need a scrap of cardboard, a paper plate, some scissors, five straws, some tape, two barbecue skewers, a balloon, and a marker. First, take your paper plate and fold it like this, making sure that the distance from here to here is shorter than one straw. Then, tape it here and here. Next, you'll need your scrap of cardboard. You'll want to pop your tape out of its dispenser and use it as a form to trace your four wheels. This will get them nice and round. Using your scissors, cut them out. Be careful and accurate. You'll want your wheels to ride smooth. Now mark the dead center on each wheel. This part's important to get just right because your wheels will wobble if the center's off. Take your two barbecue skewers. These are going to be your axles. You can use the sharp end to puncture the center of your wheels. Using a scrap of cardboard underneath, poke it through. Once it's through just a bit, and with the skewer pointed up away from your eyes and hands, press it through carefully. Now do the same for the other three wheels. Now to build your first axle. Push the barbecue skewer through one of the wheels. Then feed the straw over the skewer. This will be your hub. Then feed the blunt end of the skewer through your second wheel. Now your first axle is complete. Do the same again, and now you've got two axles and four wheels. To attach them, flip over your paper plate. One will go near the front, one near the back. Space them however you like. Make sure the hub of your axle is balanced and even. You don't want this riding crooked. When it's all even, tape it down here and here. Tape some more on the front axle, reinforce that. Maybe reinforce the back too, can't be too sturdy. Adjust your wheels, get them straight. All right, this is a nice car. Now for your tailpipe. Take your three straws, if they're bendy straws, cut off the bendy parts, and bunch them together like this. Then tape around the end as tight as you can. Tape the other end the same way. Now to assemble your propulsion system. Cut the end off your balloon and fit your tailpipe inside it an inch or so deep. Fold the balloon end tight around the tailpipe and tape it super tight. Keep taping to make an airtight connection. Now look right here. Air from the balloon could leak out of this little gap between the straws and the tape. You'll need to tape down into that crack. Press it in with your thumbnail and do the same working it around to the other two cracks. Pressing the tape down tightly to close that air gap. Your balloon rocket car won't go fast unless this part's airtight. Test it by blowing it up. If you hear air leaking, keep taping. Now insert your propulsion system into your car body and tape down the tailpipe here. Awesome, you're done! To race it, just blow it up, pinch off the tailpipe, set it down on an open runway, and let go. If it's not riding straight, adjust the axles. 